Hi everyone, I'm Chuan Wen. It's my great honor to present our work on handwritten Chinese font generation with collaborative stroke refinement. This is a joint work with Yu Jiepan, Jie Chang, Ya Zhang, Si Hengchen, Yan Feng Wang, Mei Han, and Qi Tian. Chinese font synthesis is an appealing solution for a new type of design because the Chinese language consists of more than 8,000 characters, and designing a new font requires huge human labor. Automatic generation of new typefaces is of great economic value. The deep convolutional neural, neural networks have shown great potential in the image generation area, and some recent work applying CNN for font generation tasks have achieved amazing performance. However, there are still some issues in font generation. First, the font generation is low fault tolerant, since any misplacement of strokes may change the, the semantics of the characters. Especially for the handwritten fonts, the existing models suffer from the thin issue that the generated strokes are prone to be missing or broken during deformation due to enormous blank pixels in font images. Moreover, the size of training data set is still so large that it's hard to apply, in, apply the, the existing methods to industry. At first, I'm going to introduce our first motivation. Contrary to the thin issue, we observe that thick stroke fonts can suffer fewer missing or broken strokes. So we propose a collaborative stroke refinement method. The whole model is divided into three branches dominating branch, auxiliary branch, and the refinement branch. In detail, first, the input image will be encoded by the, by the shared encoder and be decoded to a low-resolution feature map, which will be sent to dominating branch and auxiliary branch, respectively. The auxiliary branch is supervised by the both version target, which is generated from the ori original target by uh, erosion operation. Then the output of the auxiliary branch will be sent to refinement branch through max pooling layers as dil uh, dilation operation. The refinement branch convolutes the, the results of max pooling and the output will be concatenated with the intermediate feature map to compensate for the dominating branch. This will significantly avoid the stroke missing and the broken issue. And for the second point, there is an important property in the Chinese characters, the content reuse phenomenon. That is, the same radicals may present in various characters at various locations. To utilize this property, we propose online documentation. Specifically, when a paired image x and y is fed into the model, we zoom the center character region to change the, the aspect ratio. We then translate the zoomed character region horizontally or vertically. Essentially, the, the augmented training samples guide the network to learn a variety of location patterns. This is a whole model pipeline merging all the three branches and the online documentation. And here are the results of our method and baselines under 750 training samples. The first row is a printed font and the last two rows are handwritten ones. Characters in red boxes, boxes are failure samples. Results show that our model significantly outperforms baseline methods. We also conduct the user study. When the training data size, size is larger than 1550, our score begins to float up and down. Thus, we conclude that 1550 training samples have completely covered radicals or single element characters with different shapes. Additionally, when the size of the training site is 750, our method achieves even higher subjective score compared with HAN trained by 2550 pair characters. And in conclusion, we propose a collaborative stroke refinement and online documentation method to handle the generation of handwritten fonts by only, uh, with only 750 pair training samples.